Okay class, now we are going to the analysis, uh, electrochemical analysis. So the coin cell that you already been fabricated from the previous video will be analyzed using potentostat. So that will be the instrument auto lab potentostat. So the coin cell that you already been fabricated will be connected either into this uh, coin cell holder or can use this one this is also the jig for testing so let's say we are using this jig so it will be connected to the positive and negative electrode so my student will uh, show you how the assembly is done so the first electrochemical analysis will be a cyclic voltammetry so I already make a folder here in the desktop of uh, the computer and this folder consists of each group so you need to put all your data individually in the folder so the software that we are using is called nova so this is the uh, method for cv analysis so how do we conduct cv analysis so as the CV uh, details is appear here, we need to change the detail. This can be the remark or the title. Just in, uh, put any title that is suitable for your sample. The second one is to enter the mass. This will be the total mass of your electrodes. The third one, the data for repeat, repeat for each value. So click here, double click here, and you can insert the data value for your analysis. You are given a parameter here. So you need to run the experiment from 0 to 1.2 volt, and the standard will be 20, 40, 60, 80, and 100 millivolt per second. So here, the value given is in volt per second. So you need to convert uh, 20 millivolt per second to 0 0.02 up to 0 0.1 volt per second. And click OK. The next thing will be the next procedure. Click the next procedure and then go to the CV staircase. So here we start at 0 0.02 volt and the upper potential will be 1.2 volt. The lower potential will be 0 and the stop potential will be 0 0.02, stop crossing at 4. So that's it. So after you complete uh, filling all the information, you can click start. So make sure your coins are already been connected to the uh, crocodile clip before you click the start button.